Now it will be a repeat of the final game of the CONCACAF Championship last October when Jamaica's national senior women's football team faced their Panamanian counterparts on Sunday inside the National Stadium. Here's Karen Madden. Former National Technical Director René Simoes nicknamed this space The Office because the reggae boys were a formidable force when they chased World Cup glory. Now the reggae girls have not lost a game since they advanced to the World Cup back in October. They will be hoping for that same rich vein of form when they face an old foe Panama on Sunday. Head coach Hugh Menzies and assistant Lauren Donaldson are hoping the reggae girls' final home game will be a stage-setting opportunity. Well, obviously, we, we're, it's our farewell game um, for the country, so the girls are up for it. Um, obviously, Panama is, will be up for it because of what happened in October. So we wanted this game. We wanted to kind of start our World Cup early, you know, the pressure, the the adversity of the game, the expectations of the game. So we wanted to set that stage and it looks like it's going to be a good stage to set. Well, we expect, first of all, to win the game. I don't care what, who we have and what squad we have, but um, it's also a part of the preparation that, you know, we're going to play this game and we have a scrimmage in, um, in, in Florida. So we'll do some other players and then our final game in Scotland, then we go back to a mixture of the players who plays in Florida and a mixture of the players from Jamaica. So hopefully, we we'll come out and give a, we will give a good performance. And the hugely popular Khadija Bunny Shaw wants to please the fans. I mean, we've played them already, so we're familiar with them, but we just got to go out and just do what we do. You know, obviously Panama is not going to the World Cup, so we can't really focus on them. We've got to focus on our game plan and try to execute what we're trying to do right now in practice. So when Sunday comes, we just show out and just thank all the fans for coming out, especially because it's our last home game. So we just want to go out and just work hard as a team and just show Jamaica what we can do. The last time Shakira Duncan played with a reggae girl squad was in 2014, and she's pleading for the fans to come out. I'm hoping for a victory, a great environment. I'm hoping for a crowd. I would love to give our Jamaican people a show. Um, I can't ever recall I've ever played for Jam in Jamaica. I can't recall ever playing in Jamaica, so I'm actually excited about that, to actually play in front of my home crowd. So I see how that goes. Sunday's game, which starts at 6 p.m., will be the last home game before the reggae girls play a U.S. club aggregation in the United States and Scotland in Scotland before heading to Grenoble for their first game against Brazil on June 9. Karen Madden, TVJ Sports.